Welcome to Sanctum Asylum. I am Keyless, and we are playing through the woods. Now, on the last episode, we did learn that Eric is a man that is coming into villages, stealing children to take back to Fenrir through uh, through through the Bifrost, uh, which he found a piece of, and now he can travel between two realms, Asgard and and uh, you know our realm. So we're gonna. Oops. I hope that was the continue button. I don't even know what I pressed. I just start pressing random buttons. I don't know what I'm doing. But anyway, so our son Espen is, he is now, okay, we did. Oh, we've got these wolves to contend with. So we need that over there. Espen is actually following. No, you get away from me. You get away from me. How are we supposed to get this? Is he coming down here? Don't you come down here. I gotta get past him. And I'm not sure how to do that. Let's see. I wonder if I can go this way? Or if he's just gonna come after me. Uh, it looks like what? Red Raiding Hood. I got an achievement. And also a glitch. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that face totally scared me. Totally freaked me out. The glitch really didn't help. Can you just go away? No, he's, he's on top of me now. He's like, nope. Negative. Hey, go away! Oh! That's okay. So, I did not know that we could burn them with our torch, which is actually a flashlight, which totally works. Yeah, get out of here. So, we should take this, though. Okay, we'll wave the torch. Wave it! Wave! Wah, wah, wah. Okay, we're gonna keep going. Where is it? I'm gonna burn ya. You dirty dog. Oh, here we go. So I can't seem to get up there. I don't know if it's important, but it's not happening. Unless we go around? Oh, we can. We can go around. Okay, so what is over here? Oh, a cooking pot. Well, while we're here, I guess we'll have dinner. Oh, that just reminded me I'm hungry. Wow, like in real life, I'm kind of hungry now. Damn, I had to mention food. All right, let's see. We're going to have both the flashlight and the torch out. Huh, I'm not going in circles, am I? Kind of feel like I am. Ah, so we hear a wolf. We definitely hear one. What's down here? Nothing. Hmm. I don't know if this is the right way. Oh, okay, so there's a house down there. Huh. It's got to be freezing cold out here. I've got to have... Frostbite or hypothermia sneaking up on me or something. This is terrible. Oh, so we can come in here. Wow, there's a checkpoint. Let's see. I don't know what the difference is between the moon and the sunlight. I mean, really, the, the light from the moon is just a reflection of the sunlight, right? I don't know. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, I fell. Please, I just want to find. Oh no, he bit me! How did he get me? I was waving my torch. Well, that didn't help. Why do I have this damn thing if it doesn't do anything? Okay, let's go back down here. We'll see. I guess I still can't get too close to them. Please. 
son, I can hear you talking. Do you understand me? Oh, there, 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 there. I don't know how. What? I don't even. I don't even understand. Please, don't kill me. I know about you. I know you're trapped here. Yeah, burn! Leave me alone! I am not food! So, so the difference is that, um... Oops, hello. The difference is, the sunlight is the torch, and the moonlight is my flashlight. I don't know why or how that works, but, but that's what it is. Sorry, I was trying to turn up the volume. I think it's kind of late. There we go. Yeah. See, I sacrificed myself to give you guys a better experience. Look at that. I'm just such a nice guy. So let's try... I think we were going the right way, mostly. Please. I just want to find my son. <laughs> I can hear you talking. Do you there, easy, easy mode. Me? She smells full of blood. Please, don't kill me. I know about you. I know you're trapped here. They're trapped in this dimension? Okay, so it can climb up the stairs, right? Burn! Okay, so where are we trying to get to, though? Whoa, 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 whoa. There he goes. Uh, no, 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 no! God, got us again! Um, if I knew where to go, this would be a lot easier, but I'm really struggling to see the path here. I thought I was on the right, right track, but I guess not. Please, I just burn, burn. My son. I okay, there. Are you talking? Do you understand me? So they can talk, but I think they're talking in another language. Norwegian. Please, don't kill me. I know about you. I know you're trapped here. Indeed, I would enjoy watching her confront him. Humans are so protective of their young. You guys are dicks. Okay, I'm, I'm worried about this one. This one's the one that keeps getting me. But I need to go down here. So, is this a pool of water? Oh, I cannot, I cannot go there. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can go around this way. And we're gonna try and go up here. This door isn't opened. Um, uh. What, they can't come up here? You bastards! I can help you, just let me go! Please! Can we? Oh, they can't understand me. What do I have to bargain with? I can open one of the doors. I have one of the keys. She can let us out. We can be free again. So, I can let you out of here. I just want to be left alone. Perhaps we can come to an arrangement. I know a little of her tongue. Let me speak. Human, you wish to bargain with us. Oh God, I can let you out of the ravine if you promise to let me go. You realize what this will mean for the Isle. You know our reputation. Yeah, they're gonna kill people. I don't give a shit about this island. I just want to find my son. Very well. We have an agreement. The key opens the door behind you. Go and open it. 
we will remain here. Then you may leave. I don't see. Huh? That's it? How do I know you won't just kill me afterwards? Huh. You don't. But neither do you have a wealth of options. If you would prefer to stay here, you may. We are unable to die, so we shall see who sees first. Besides which, we understand you have somewhere you wish to be, come son up. You may decide. Fine. If one of you comes near me, I am going to throw this key and good luck unlocking this door with your paws. <laughs> Okay, so I don't understand why I needed to bargain with them. They won't come up here, and I have the key to this door, so there's no... I really don't want to let them out. So they're free. I mean, I don't... I don't know about the village. What's this? Is this where we go, or is this where they go? Oh, can they not come through here? Okay, so it's good that I went this way. They're after... Hell take you, human. She very well might. Yeah, hell yeah. Helheim? I don't know. Alright, we should not have bargained with them. I'm just saying, that was a bad idea. Oh, we don't have our torch anymore. I guess we don't need it. So I can't open all of these doors. I only had that single key. Another hanged man. Let's see if we can get in here. No, this is... This is buried. This has been here for a while. Hmm. Well, we're not going down that way. Aha! Uh, this should be the path. I could be mistaken. Huh, why am I confused? So, it's kind of pointing me in this direction, but there's nowhere to go from here. Oh, I can fall. Oh, oh, and I'm fine. <laughs> wow, she's a good jumper. Or faller? She's good at falling? A skill's a skill. Bjorn. Tis a sad thing about Bjorn's daughter. But he gave her to Eric bravely. And we was all proud of him. I saw him staring into the mire. As if he had a mind to wander there again. We saw the light of Eric's torch returning from Vargfield. In the dim light this morn. Safe for another handful of years. Sent out our sorrows to him, and Bjorn both. Wow, willingly sacrificing your child? I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it! What's in here? Push it over. Push it over! She can't. She cannot do it. Well, I hope falling down here was the right choice. The fire was terrifying. The thought that Espen crossed that place made my bones cold. I thought you didn't love him. The marsh sucked all the emotion out of me. I was haunted, hounded by a hopelessness I didn't understand. Hmm. I forgot Espen's face. I forgot my own. I sometimes wish I could forget it all again. You gotta focus on the task at hand. It's easy to get emotional before the end, you know. But you never know. You know, you never know what's going to happen next. Espen's still alive. We're still alive. There's still hope. There's still a possibility that we'll... Weasel our way out of this situation. Oh, yeah, what the... F Alright, I don't know if this thing's hostile or what. But I don't even want to mess with it. That is freaky. What the hell? Is there anything down here? 
I don't see anything. What the hell? Nope. Nope. No. We're leaving. Hey, there's more. There's more. Why are there even one? Gah. No, you stay over there. Oh, wow. So, there are dead Vikings everywhere. I don't know if they're hostile or not. I really don't want to find out, though. How are they even walking around? What the hell? They're like gargling. Okay, let's keep moving. We don't want to stop for too long. That's how a zombie catches you. It's when you pause. Okay, that's just a tree, but that's definitely an undead viking. Okay, we're gonna go around. They're kind of funneling us in a certain direction, I feel like. Here, what's this say? Oh, oh. Um, Bargenveld. And, don't know, so we'll go to the named village instead of the one with the faces and the... Oh, here's a, here's a save. Whoa, 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 whoa. You gotta be kidding me. Phantoms now? Oh, what the hell? Am I really going down there? Ooh. That is a monster. That is a giant wolf. What is that thing? All right. You know what? Let's see if this door opens, and then we'll go face that beast. Oh! Oh, it's just a corpse. Oh, but with a child. Look at that. Oh. Bedarbi Niflung. Mist children. Left out in the misty marsh, far away from Eric's reach. Taken by something else. Mud and a strange smell reek from the wrappings. Most likely taken in by the water whites. To live with the drogs, or maybe hell even took it itself. Huh. Oh, okay, so we can't go in here. We probably don't want to anyway. There's something knocking at that door. Look, I've got a shiner! Man, that guy hit me pretty hard, huh? Well, it did knock me to the ground, so... Okay, you just stay asleep. I think it's moving. It's definitely breathing. Human, help me. Holy shit. Hello? Human, I have waited. My mistress. Okay, but don't eat us. You got a thorn in your foot or something? What can I possibly help you with? What do you need? Jesus. What are you? How are you still alive? There's nothing left of you. I am Garm, guardian of the gates. Oh, it's Garm. Guardian of hell. The veiled lady. I was those things. Too old. Too weak. Unimportant. Help me. Ow. The veiled lady is Hale? Are you really saying Hale is out here somewhere? I don't know how I can help you. End my suffering. Aww. My despair. You want me to kill you? I can't do that. The rock above. The spire. Bring it down upon me. Hmm. There's no way to help you recover, huh? Would I want to do that even if I could? Man, I don't know. That's terrible. I don't want to do this. Seems like a nice enough pup. Kind of big, though. Kind of scary. So how do I get up there? I'm supposed to push this thing out onto him, right? How do I get there? Oh, I can't climb. Oh, here. Maybe I can just... No? Oh, I think I have to go around. Okay, I have to go down here and around. 
Let's see here. Oh man, I'm doing this, huh? All right, I guess. Thank you, God. Oh no. Oh, that's terrible. I didn't want to do that. Well, it's what he wanted. He is very, very dead now. All right. That's horrible. Oh, I'll be sleeping with nightmares tonight. Uh huh. All right. So. Singing, the witch. I don't want to face a witch, though. Not with a flashlight. Okay, so there's a checkpoint. You have one just like it at home, Espen. Really? Come on. Mom! You're gonna torment me with this? Listen to your mother now, Espen. Espen, you're not having it. Let's go. I want this, Mom! No! Come here! Jesus, what did you do? Espen, I'm so sorry! I'm sorry, Espen! Oh, Accidentally hurt him? No! Please! Why are you doing this? I didn't! It. Yeah, I mean, kids can hurt themselves just by struggling when you're trying to, uh, you know, prevent them from doing something. You tell them what happened. No, for God's sake, if we tell them what I did, I'll lose the firm. They'll take Espen away. We have to. It's the right thing to do. Please, please don't say anything. Uh, it was an accident. I didn't mean it. I know. I know it. It just feels wrong. Yes, but we'll get through it. Let's just get through it together. Okay? I love you. Please stop. Please. That's pretty messed I up. I didn't mean it. That they would bring Don't that up. Don't show me anymore. That they would bring that up. That's That sucks. Is it the witch is doing? You want a what? A divorce, God damn it! I want a divorce! There it is at last. Fine. You're welcome to one. But I'm taking Espen. You're not taking my son! Well, I'm not leaving him with you. You broke his arm, for Christ's sake. <sighs> when will you stop holding that over my fucking head? It was an accident. An accident! And you've looked at me every day since, like I'm some kind of monster! I'm telling you now. If you want a divorce, no. Espen is coming with me. You bitch! Please stop it! I quit. I give up. Just don't show me anymore. No. That is pretty messed up. I don't know, I mean... It's hard raising a kid. You're not given a manual and... And yeah, you know, sometimes you... You get frustrated. You, don't know your own strength, you know, compared to a child. I don't know. I'd hate to say, oh, it's okay that she broke her kid's arm. Like, of course it's not. Of course that's She's not okay. lying. I never hit her or Espen. I swear, please. Silence. Sit down now. I find in favor of the plaintiff, Miss Dahl. She shall retain sole custody of her son, Espen Dahl. Wow. The defendant shall have no visitation rights, and a permanent restraining order comes into effect immediately. You, sir, are to have no contact with your ex-wife or Espen whatsoever, and must keep a minimum distance of 200 feet from them, their home, Espen's school, and her place of work. Wow. Court is adjourned. No. Please, God damn it, let go of me! Don't! Please, don't take him away from me. Don't take him I wonder away if she from did me. lie. Please, I'll stop. Eric can have him. I can't. Hmm. I don't want to see what comes next. Please don't. That'd be pretty harsh if she did lie to get full custody and um, take away any rights for the father that'd be kind of messed up 
But at the same time, I mean, he was threatening her too. You know, she just played his game and she happened to win. And the mom always will when it comes to custody of a kid. There's no easy way to say this, so I'll just say it. Your husband was found dead in his apartment. This oh. Day. Oh, God. Oh, no. Right now, we're working on the assumption of suicide that we were investigating. You're safe now. You and Espen are finally safe. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I wish I could take it back. It's the worst thing I've ever done. And I loved him. I did. I loved my son, too. I would have done anything to keep him close. I just had no idea his father would... That he... <laughs> I made one terrible mistake and I ruined everything. I'll never forgive myself. Are you happy now, you bitch? Maybe she's in hell and she's having to relive like these terrible things. I don't know. I can't imagine. I mean, I haven't had a perfect life either. If somebody rubbed in my face all the things I've done wrong. Oh no, that'd be harsh. That sucks, man. I've never done something quite as bad as what she did, but... The sun is starting to come up. I'm not going to make it. Oh, the sun's starting to come up. Let's get through here. I don't know. All of that's kind of messed me up a little bit. Leaves a bad taste in your mouth. For sure. She seems sorry, though. I don't know. I don't know if that matters. Um. Wow, I don't know what these are. There sure are a lot of them here, though. Oh, and look. Hmm. And now there's rumbling. Rumble, rumble. Wow. So what is this place? Now I'm very curious. I'm, I'm going to go explore it. Look, that's a giant, it looks like. Obviously made of stone, but... A giant stone thing. Oh, how did that... Oh, these came out of the ground very quickly. Oh... Huh. I wonder if that's part of the Bifrost. These are all fragments of the Bifrost. That's just a guess. I have no idea. I really don't know. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything over there, and it looks like this is the way to go. But a Viking village this primitive... I don't know. I don't know where it came from or why it exists or a lot of things, I guess. Oh, a note. The sacrifice to Eric's tale. The rumbling ceased and there was finally peace. The war was ended. Eric fell to his knees and keened in anguish. But the people finally saw the truth. They would have to give their sons and daughters one every five years if they were to survive. So ended Eric's tale. So... So I wonder if that means we're getting to the end here? I thought we'd see more giants though. Okay, so this is definitely the way to go. Are these steps? Yeah, they're steps. Huh. And we're going around here. Oh, there is, there's a whole thing. Um, wow, that's a big building. Wow, what is that? Something moving, or is there a thunderstorm coming? I don't... I guess I don't need the flashlight right now. Um, yeah, it's... it's 
the sun's coming up, so there's the sun. There's no more moon. Wow, so there were giants here. There were giants here. This one's dead. It looks like it took one in the uh, rib cage there. I don't know if if that happened after it was already dead or what, or if it killed it. Ah, oh, here this looks like a checkpoint. All right, so are we going past this or? I am very confused. Now, now we've come up to this. Now where do we go from here? Oh god. Wow, look at that. Looking down on it. It's gotta be that way, right? Ah, oh, there's steps. Look at that boat. Look at that boat up there. Wow, that's a big one. That's a big boat. Holy Christ. Oh my god. The wolf is real. What wolf? I didn't see anything. How did I miss a wolf? A giant wolf? What happened? Alright. Let's take a look at the boat. Inside the boat must be... Wow. This is a big one. It's a big boat. More hanged people. Oh, we can go up here. Okay, I see. Wow. Let's be careful here a little bit. Uh, I don't know how your balance is, but... Wow. Okay, so now I'm lost again. <laughs> uh, do I need to jump down, or... Oh yes, okay. And we'll continue through here. I'm glad she doesn't take um, fall damage too easily. Like, she does very well. What is happening right now? And where did she see a giant wolf? I didn't see a wolf. Is she high? Oh, that was close. Wow, look at that. Wow. I wonder if we're traveling between dimensions here. Or time? Maybe we're stuck in a different time. Whoa. Oh. That's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. So he's throwing children straight into its mouth. How can it be so large? Yeah, don't jump. I missed you too, little man. Please come away from the edge. I have to do this, Mom. Do you understand? No. Espen, you don't. There are other children. It doesn't have to be you. Shut your mouth, you fucking coward. He's just doing his job. He's been protecting us, all of us. Look at him. Just want to do it. Espen, I love you. And I'm proud of you. You're very brave. But I don't want you to do this. Please. Please. I need you. I love you, Mom. And I'm proud of Espen. you, too. Espen! No! Don't! Espen, no! Oh. Oh, they all go? I feel like I fell, too. Wow. I don't know of any kid that would willingly throw himself into the mouth of a ginormous... Espen! Espen! Please don't leave me. Oh, 
That was pretty intense there. Wow. I didn't expect I didn't expect Espen to not make it. I did not expect that. It was a good game, it was pretty intense, very dramatic. Um, the Viking theme was very unusual for for the theme, I guess. Not a bad thing. I enjoyed it. It was a good game. Man. Thanks for joining me on this Let's Play, um, and I will see you for the next.